I'm gonna be uh, acknowledging Xander's uh, how long can you hold your breath underwater challenge. And uh, there's no, he said no camera tricks, so I guess I won't do camera tricks, but I will skip ahead most likely because uh, you're gonna be here for a while. So. I'm gonna fill in a little bit more. Good morning, everyone. Hope you're all having a fantastic day because I know I will. You might be able to recognize this place again. And uh, over here, I'm actually gonna start off the vlog by uh, exploring this area. Yeah, this is the place where the fence had a hole and a train track and I it out and then went back. So I'm not gonna it out this time. I'm actually gonna uh, go into there and uh, explore it very thoroughly because if I can uh, run over here real quick like but uh, right here is where this is and then all the way up here that says emergency exit so supposedly there's an emergency exit on that side which is over there where I just was in that direction we'll check that out I'm gonna go back over there because it was a decent trip all right and I'm back so Right now, I am actually going to go through the hole, go into the depths of uh, Tartarus, and uh, I guess we'll see what we find. All right, we're in, boys. So I went a little bit, I went a little bit into this area last time, but then I, I quit and I just kinda, I went back. So I'm gonna go pretty far or as far as I feel is necessary until I can find, I can kind of get the gist of this place and figure out why it was blocked off. Because I don't understand why it would be blocked off, it's just forest. I mean, like I said in the last video, it's probably because of the train tracks, but I'm not sure. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of trash on the ground. Like, it looks tech trash, too. You know, it'd be a real, really cool thing is if a train went by just about now. Because then I could film it and it might be uh, a cool transition. Let's see. Pretty cool. I know, right? Just a track. That's amazing. What a fantastic find. Hey, it's a cool find, alright? Because. Train tracks are always cool in my opinion. I don't know why. I like them. I'm not gonna go in that one because I know it's live and uh, I'm not gonna risk my life to get a cool Instagram photo. Now I'm a little bit sketchy around this formation. Who knows what would be hiding behind that. What I really wanna find is a cave. I love caves, dude. Okay, this is what I saw before. Graffiti. There was a deer which kind of slink. What's the word? Slinked into the shadows. That's all right. It's just a deer, as far as I know. Um, I'm trying to think. Where can I go to make it interesting? I might as well follow the goddamn trail. All right, all right, all right. This is getting to the point of uh, most likely return because I see ants on the floor. I don't like that. You guys know this, so uh, I'm probably gonna be out because the trail kind of ends. I know I'm being weak, I'm out. But again, I don't want to get ants all over my as well as poison ivy because that's a thing. 
All right. So I was just walking up to my spot where I was gonna film a, another one of them skits. And as you can see, this is what the wind does to my hair. Because every time I go up here, I swear to God, the wind is blowing in the exact opposite direction that my hair is supposed to go. And so it just absolutely, it just does this. Like what, what, what is this? I look like a man scientist. This should actually be it for the content wise. And then I'll end with a little skit here, which uh, I'll transition to now. Take it away, Professor Banks. Welcome to another seminar. My name is Professor Banks, but you can just call me dumbass. Today, I will be teaching you secret parkour techniques that no one in the world has ever heard of or seen before. Now this is a very exclusive video, so listen closely. The reason no one has heard of these before is because I created them and I founded them by searching in the pits of Tartarus, bringing up these techniques. Now you are very special because you get to learn these. Now this first technique, I call the 360 object clear. It may sound simple, but it's actually a very, very difficult technique to execute. Let me demonstrate. Now this next one I call the sweep step dirt roll. You can't say it fast or else you'll get your tongue literally in a knot. I call this next technique the friendly starfish. You'll see why in a second. I'm now going to go through a bunch of techniques, so pay attention and watch closely so you can follow along. The roly-poly. The phoenix plop. The Xander. The Heartman. The Walkover Vault. The Step Over Vault. The Back Tumble. You may have seen this technique used in my last video. The Cannonball. The Looper. The Oh shit, I just hit my shin. The fancy vault. The side flip vault. The oh shit, it's a ninja vault. Maybe wondering, why do I have a log? Why do you curls with? This one, it can take many, many years to master. But once you have, it looks awesome. This is. Jai Master. All right, that is the vlog, you guys. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Those skits will be coming out on a more regular basis now, and uh, hopefully I can do, I guess, more tomorrow than I did today. I didn't have too much to be done. That's why I didn't vlog as much. But until then, I will see you guys tomorrow. Cheers. I absolutely done fucked that one up. All right, let's try that again. See you guys tomorrow. Cheers. Uh